This challenges my understanding of the universe, even as a physicist. Here in the basement of ETH in Zurich, Switzerland, we have tested one of the most profound and strange features of quantum physics, non-locality. In daily life, our actions only directly influence our immediate surroundings. When I snap with my fingers here in Zurich, people in New York won't notice, at least not immediately. In the quantum world, however, particles can influence each other instantaneously, even at great distances. This is tested in a so-called loophole-free Bell test. To illustrate, meet my professor Andreas. Andreas and I will simultaneously toss a normal coin each. As expected, we get independent results. If we now take coins following the rules of quantum physics, however, they will always show correlated results. This is because quantum particles can be made to behave as twins through a phenomenon called entanglement. The astonishing thing about it, this strong correlation in the coin tosses remains even if Andreas were far away in New York or even on the other side of the galaxy. In our experiment, instead of two coins, we use two superconducting circuits the building blocks of quantum computers. We operate them in two separate refrigerators at temperatures colder than outer space. The qubits are connected through a cold waveguide, which we use to entangle them, turning them into twins. For this purpose, we have them exchange a photon that travels through the waveguide. We then toss the quantum coins, meaning we simultaneously perform a randomly chosen measurement on the two qubits. We repeat this process a million times. To ensure no classical interaction between the two quantum coins is possible, we place them 30 meters apart. And we record the results at either side quickly enough so that no signal from the other side could possibly influence the outcome. We observed that the correlation of the measurement results of the two qubits is so strong that no classical effect could possibly reproduce it. Our experiment shows for the first time with millimeter-sized superconducting electronic circuits, the building blocks of quantum computers, that nature is indeed non-local at its heart. This setup lies the foundation to extend the powers of quantum computers by creating non-local networks. For example, for quantum secured communication and distributed computing.